I stopped in Emily City today to visit the Halloween store downtown. And I tell you, I was impressed. This store is really well stocked with an incredible range of merchandise. Uh, from value price to top of the line commercial grade equipment and decorations. This store really has everything. It puts the local spirit Halloween stores to shame. I mean, there's just so much more to choose from here. The costume selection is second to none. You look down these rows of merchandise here, and both sides of them are stuffed full with different costumes. And it's a nice variety of licensed merchandise, generic costumes, uh, vintage, adult and children's. Just so many different topics and themes and characters to choose from. And the prices are really very reasonable. I mean, there's kids' costumes here starting at like $12 to $15. And adult costumes go all the way up to a couple hundred dollars. But it really all depends on how elaborate you want and what character you're looking for. It's just really a very impressive store for such a rural location here in Lapeer County. I just, I was honestly impressed and amazed at the collection of merchandise that RJ has put together here in his business location. I was thinking about buying that green head up there for myself, but I haven't decided yet. Even these really well done masks up overhead, most of them are in the 30 to $50 range. Although he does have some even more expensive better quality ones that he sells look at that 30 bucks for that alien costume i think it was the same for the ghostbusters costume just really creepy stuff some fun and happy stuff really whatever you want you can find here at the halloween store in downtown emily city let's just wander around and browse a little bit more these are mostly the accessories and tools and weapons to go with your costume in this section. And then way in the back, you'll find another room filled with accessories, more costumes, Halloween decor for your house and yard. It just goes on and on all the way to the very back. And yeah, there's unmentionable costumes. Wildlife, medical, steampunk, adventure type stuff. I mean, just anything you can imagine. Let's see what else. All right. A whole bunch of hats and accessories back here. Look at all the hats. And then back in the corner are pumpkin carving and other home decor items to go along with your costume to make your Halloween home party just a huge success. And this creepy ghouly guy would be a nice addition. I'm not so sure about the little dolls. They kind of creep me out. Right, here's some costumes for smaller children. Some happy bags and stuff. Uh, some Zelda costume from Nintendo. That's pretty cool. What else do we have here? Oh, some more masks. Temporary tattoos, masks, etc. And characters you might recognize. I certainly don't know most of these myself, but um, some Day of the Dead items. They even have a nice selection of costumes for your pets. You dress up your dog or cat for the holidays. Look at this. You know, might as well get the whole family in on it, right? And I had such a fun time looking around this store today. If you're on a budget, you should still come here too because you'll get something that's better quality than what you'll find in the big box stores. And RJ was telling me that today he outfitted a family with five kids... I think he said it was right around $125 to get all five of them set up with something cute for Halloween. 
And they'll go out of their way to help you here too. They know their merchandise, they know what you need or want, and they'll show you around and make suggestions for you so that you can find just the right costume, accessories, or decorations for Halloween. Makeup, oh, look at, we have makeup, temporary tattoos, fingernails, eyelashes, all the theatrical props and accessories you need to make your outfit look great. Facial hair, beards, mustaches, heads. plush soft animal furry heads, I guess we call them. And something that RJ says one of his most popular things in the store are the theatrical contact lenses to change the appearance of your eyes. And those are really cool. Have a look here. Oh, yeah, that's good. You just put those in like regular contacts, right? Yep, just wear them like regular contacts. And, and they're make... reusable. You can use them for a couple of years as long as you keep them dry, uh, keep them in the solution. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And they change the whole appearance. It makes a real extra special touch to the you know, authenticity of your costume, I would think. Mm -hmm. All right, good. Yeah. Hey, now we got to get a You got nice windows, too. These windows are really nice. Did you guys paint those yourselves? Uh, my cousin painted them for me. Must be quite a artist because those are nice. So I hope you'll come on down and see RJ or his staff at 149 East 3rd Street in downtown Emily City. This is also the second year that they're operating a fun haunted house attraction a couple of blocks down on the south side of 3rd Street in the old fire hall. You want to check that out too. And here's the other store that RJ owns here in Emily City called A Little Bit of Everything. And it's kind of like a closeout store where they sell discount, discontinue merchandise, return pallet merchandise, and just about anything you can imagine. They do a lot of Christmas stuff here too after Halloween's over. So stop in and check that out as well.